New tonight, sounds of engines rumbling across Gay Street. Downtown Knoxville neighbors say they have had enough, and Knoxville police are tackling those concerns. Good evening, and thank you for watching Fox 43 News at 10. I'm Katie Inman. Reporter Maria Guzman shares the reality neighbors are reliving every week. It feels like Pigeon Forge and Rod Run have come to Gay Street. For more than 10 years, Kevin Gremick has called Gay Street home, but home has come with recent disturbances. Over 100 motorcycles on both sides of the yellow line. So this is, in, in effect, shut down Gay Street. A coming car or vehicle trying to go southbound over the Gay Street Bridge, it's impassable. He says in the last two weeks, motorcyclists and cars have flooded his neighborhood. Sunday evening, 5 o'clock, the motorcycles. Has to be a planned orchestrated event for, to have over 100 motorcycles. And sounds of their exhaust are his new neighborhood noise. They'll be backed up to the red light and they will rev their engines to unbelievable noise levels. In response, the Knoxville Police Department issued 17 citation, 17 warning citations, and four noise ordinance violations. I own a motorcycle and I am a motorcycle enthusiast, but. But the, the law, we need to follow the law. That's just all we can ask. KPD Central District officers are focusing their patrol efforts directly to address noise ordinance violations. Every day it's bustling. And that's uh, the sad part of our success. Downtown is, is doing great, but uh, obviously that brings all types. Our reporter Maria Guzman joins us now. Maria, the city has used different methods to try and track those noise complaints. Last year, the city studied numbers from noise camera installed in downtown. Now, those numbers showed that from February to April, 486 noise events were captured by a noise camera. Now, that mostly happened from 7 at night to 3 in the morning. Katie. Maria, thank you.